Okay. Welcome back. All right, I'm going to talk about how this possibly connects up, at least information-wise, that this is showing where the information shows a possible connection with this date. And once again, I'm not sure what's going to happen on this date. I really, really have no idea. I really don't. I'm not telling you that something's going to happen. I'm only showing you what this information is showing, what it's telling me, and what it's told me before, and what's happened in the past. But I just simply don't know. I, you know, of course, plan for the worst, hope for the best. So let's talk about these numbers real quick. We know that on September 11, 2001, was the World Trade Center attack. We know that on March 11, 2011, was the Japan attack. Now we have this date, which would be November 11, 2011. Is this the possible Goyam attack, the beginning of the depopulation event, the initiation of the NWO? and the beginning of the false doctrine of these beings that say that they come from the stars. Now, let's look at the numbers. 11, 11, 11, this way. Of course we have 11, 11, 11, this way. If you count up all of these ones, it's 11. And of course, 2, 2, 2. Well, that's that number 6. Now, for some of you who are numerologists, which I'm not, there's probably more significance than what I can explain. Feel free to expand. If we take the number value for the month, September is the 9th, March is the 3rd, November is the 11th, they add up to 23. Now, I don't know if any of you are familiar with the term called the 23 Enigma. Google it and check it out because very significant things are accompanied by the number 23. Now, I also know that this in numerology can be equated as 666. And then also, as we know, that 11, 11, 11, if you look at the barcode, the beginning of the barcode on the outside, you have two close lines. They're the exact identical length and identical thickness, and then you have all the random ones. And in the middle, there's two more distinct lines, which are the exact same as these before. And then there's the random code, and then on the end are the two lines again. The computer reads this in the barcode language as 666. Six, six. And as you can also see, that would be the long drawn, drawn out lines being 11, 11, 11. Now, if we look at this here, we've got 311. Now, that's absolutely, definitely ingrained in the minds of a lot of people for a band is named in that particular manner which is just a little strange I mean it's just so strange so in other words we have this connection you know this connection now I'd like to say that on a previous video I was I was looking at a video that I did some five days ago when I had no plans to do this what I'm doing here right now and the video is the Ezekiel wheel number 21 21 is three sevens. This is where all this started on that video I did, which is entitled, I am Indigo 777. Okay? Indigo, I am one, 777. On that video, Ezekiel Wheel, you're going to see that I say, Bombshell. Ezekiel Wheel, number 21, you're going to see that it says, Bombshell. Another incredible connection.